I was supposed to be vlogging and I totally forgot. I'm so sorry. I didn't really do much. I cleaned my house. I went and got some fills, of course. And then I uh, hung out with my neighbor. I love how it is just beautiful weather. We're walking. It's cute. They definitely move somewhere from the desert because they're like trying to bring that desert to the ocean. <laughs> I'm like, that gate is so tacky. Like, I'm sure it cost them hella money. You guys, there's this house on my street that I've been like manifesting. So everyone join me in manifesting this house because I want to buy it. Look at that blue house. That blue house is so cute. <sighs> so cute. Um, I would change the front door though. Sometimes crossing the street is a risk because you've got cars coming and they are speeding. Jesus. We did like our TV there with the bed in the back. It's the most efficient use of space. It really is. Eventually we're gonna, I'm gonna pop up in the top and extend it. Oh, you oh, are? Nice. And I'm gonna put the bed over the cat. Oh, okay, okay. Ah. Yeah, like. My back is killing me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you can do your back shut in. This is yeah. the stretch. Yeah, the driving. <laughs> yeah. Like stretch that out and like literally that saved my life. Oh, we just met the nicest like van lifers um, at the beach, oh, and it just made me so reminiscent of Leon and I's road trip. And now I'm sad, and I want to leave again. Like you know, we still have our van, obviously, um, but I want to go somewhere. Hi. <laughs> Got my shot. Run, go. People flying kites. Should I go like this? Should I be like Kelly Stamps? Yeah. Right? Watch it was. <laughs> or one of Penelope's siblings. Hey, come on. Vladimir. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Are they just sitting? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't do it either still because there's sharks. <laughs> Was that Vladimir? <laughs> His favorite. I think that was like a hey, notice me bar. <laughs> Fullness everywhere. Oh God. Okay, Vladimir. <laughs> 
chasing the German Shepherd. <laughs> so we're leaving the dog beads. That was fun. But I have a little bit of a dog beads rant. Like, literally, if you don't want your dogs to play, don't bring them to the dog beach. Like, if your dog is rude, don't bring them to the dog beach. And if you just want to sit in the sand and you don't want your dog to play with anyone's dog and you just want to relax and take pictures, don't go to the dog beach. Basically, if you don't want to be bothered and you want to sit in some sand, don't go to the dog beach. That's basically the moral of the story. That's it. Oh, that means cross children. When we walk down the street like this, I feel like the girls in the sex in the city.